Hello my dear family members if you are preparing for virtues the interview then you must know few important things for the interview because they are asking few important new questions new type of questions i'll discuss those all of those questions just to wait and watch this video till the end and if you want me to upload specific video related to tester or developer role then this video and this playlist will also help you a lot and if you have to travel to your interview location if you want to know all of these questions then this video is for you just before that guys please make sure that you are subscribing this channel and watching the playlist of cognizant capgemini accenture hertusa or any company that you want and let me know which content do you want more by commenting me that you want more virtuosa content interview preparations or accenture content or any other content then let me know by commenting and don't forget to like this video now let me discuss the first question that is uh you do you have to travel to your interview location then the answer is yes most of you have to travel back to your interview location let's say they have the campus at hyderabad and if you are from any locations like uh, bhubaneswar kolkata or any other locations if they have scheduled the interview at hyderabad then please be sure that you have to travel to hyderabad campus so plan accordingly you will have that much of time like let's say five to seven days you will have that much of time and you have to travel uh, within this span of time okay now let me discuss the next question that is uh, can you share the specific questions for tester or developer let's discuss that hey you ready for the future tech no uf is here with premium prep materials no need to fear cognizant accenture tcs and more we'll get you ready open up that door so the question we got from the candidate is first questions are these for tester roles okay and please wait for if you are from developer role because this will also help you for your developer interview okay so the first concept questions was related to oops concept okay so you have to know about as i have been telling you from the very beginning that you have to know about the concept of encapsulation then uh the all pillars of oops okay so please go through four pillars of oops and their types uh polymorphism types of polymorphisms and abstractions type of abstractions possible with syntax with examples please go through all of those and very uh, from the common sense you can say that you have to know about the template answer for uh, let's say intro and template answer for your project questions okay i'm not i'm not discussing all of those i'm just discussing only technical questions in this video okay now the next question was very important and this is the new things you have to know you have to worry about because let's say uh, some people are doing fraud some people are giving access to their system to someone else external person okay and they are giving the exam but they don't know what's the question they have asked what is the question in virtusa they have faced so for those the interviewer are asking the questions like write any one programming questions asked in your exam you already have gone through the power coding and regular coding round so you must know the questions from power coding and regular coding let's say even if you don't remember at the time of the interview then please tell any questions which appears in your mind because the interviewers also don't know what questions they have asked to you okay so if you use your presence of mind that also helps in the interview okay so that's why actually last venture uh got the selections not the first venture so please use your presence of mind and keep the answer always try to at least remember one coding questions which you have answered and explain that in the interview or one thing you can do please uh, be ready with any questions randomly pick up from uh, google and be ready with that questions if the interviewer interviewer ask you the questions like write any one programming questions asked in your exam then explain that questions only even if that not have appeared in your exam okay now the next question is sql joins second highest salary okay second highest salary this is must be prepared okay because these questions are being repeated so you can solve uh, in two to three ways you have to explain all the approaches to your interviewer so that they can know about your uh, like the knowledge the vast knowledge you have okay 
सो सब क्वेरीज नॉर्मल मेथड नॉर्मल ज्वाइन मेथड स्टेट्स टा यू हैव टू मेंशन दैट सो नाउ द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन आर फ्रॉम टेस्टिंग ओके एस द कैंडिडेट वाज फ्रॉम टेस्टिंग रोल सो दैट्स व्हाई दे हैव आस्ट क्वेश्चंस फ्रॉम टेस्टिंग बिफोर आई मूव टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन आई वांट यू टू हैव द बेस्ट प्राइम मटेरियल्स अवेलेबल फॉर परचूज द इंटरव्यू प्रिपरेशन और एनी इंटरव्यू इन योर अपकमिंग टाइम because here we have included all the c++ java python dbms sql coding operating system networking machine learning cloud computing managerial questions puzzle questions hr questions testing developer for all of you the questions are available here now if they have asked you about the testing types you can see selenium locators expert types etc so the basically questions will be asked from manual testing manual testing stlc methods and and let's say agile methods then that all the types of manual testings you have to know okay if you are from developer role then parallelly you have to understand the sdlc method like the waterfall method then spiral method then the b model then the agile methodology okay and what are the loopholes available in each model and what are the resolutions made in the next uh, model you have to know about that basically they have been asking these type of questions okay now the next important questions which i have to discuss for you that is the type of uh, testing okay because this is being faced by many candidates so that's why i have to share a few important things till i had written these when i was joining in cognizant and there i used to teach my colleagues about the testing so let me just discuss these questions so that you you will know better okay so the things have two types like static and dynamic static has three types review work through and inspections and dynamic has four uh, four types like unit testing integration testing system testing and and uat testing okay user acceptance testing and all of these have several types further subdivided into three parts like unit testing path basis control structure mutation testing and integration testing has two parts like non incremental and incremental incremental has three types top down hybrid and bottom up and unit testing and integration testing these are called white box testing why white box because in these testing we have access to the codes so this is that's why it's called white box testing okay but system testing and the uat testing this these are called black box here we don't have access to the uh, system access to the codes okay the system testing further subdivided into four parts like gui testing usability testing non functional and functional testing among all of, among all of these these uh, non functional and functional testings are very important uat also important so non functional testings are divided into performance security recovery compatibility installation and sanitation testing and functional testing the most important testing types you may face in your interview those are like smoke testing sanity testing retesting regression testing ad hoc testing monkey gorilla or dinosaur testing exploratory end to end positive negative globalization localization testing these are very important okay so please, guys please go through this image you can get a clear uh, understanding about the testing and their types okay now let me discuss the next question that is from selenium locators expert types let's say this is the website and they can ask you that please find where is the subscribe button present please find the expert to get the subscribe button okay so this way they can ask you the questions from selenium expert so be ready with this type of questions okay and expert types you have to know what are the types of experts available stlc bug life cycle also you have to know api testing concepts like api testing concepts means guys uh, even if you are from developer role they may ask you these questions like uh, let's say what are the http methods available what are the http methods available these are all re related to api testing okay http methods available for http method uh, in api testing like get post push and patch all of these okay and then uh, what are the difference between them and their definitions etc then the status codes very important status codes what uh, tool do you use for api testing is this uh, let's say soap 
UI or any other if you are using any other postman API if you are using any if you don't if you know anything then please explain that but if you don't know then you can ex explain these two uh, like example soap UI and postman API okay so these are the very important tool for API testing you can explain this and the next questions are from actually HR questions the candidate has faced the questions from HR questions like uh, why do you want to join Virtusa? The first question. Second question is, do you have any questions for us? So if the interviewer asking, do you have any questions for us? Then please explain that. Uh, please tell them, uh, is there any opportunity to learn further? If I get any technology, then can I switch the technology, etc, etc. Okay. So you can ask these type of questions uh, so that they can in uh, interpret that the candidate has uh, enthusiasm to learn more enthusiasm to join Virtusa. okay so please explain this way now let me discuss few important questions for uh, developer role guys if you are from developer role then please be ready with uh, like coding knowledge okay they are asking to write the codes in front of them this is a very important questions for you that write any programming questions asked in your exam and the second important question is write the questions in front of the uh, like write any questions okay uh, like let's say palindromic questions or uh, let's say um, prime number coding or let's say uh, Fibonacci series these type of questions also you want face okay so be ready with these questions guys so I hope this much of discussion is enough for today's session if you liked this video guys please make sure that you are subscribing to this channel and watching the playlist of Capgemini, Cognizant, Accenture or any company that you want land. Let me know which content you want more and which companies are coming in your campuses so that I can make more content on those. Okay. So thank you for the attention guys.